Hey everybody, it's your boy Seller Stick. Oh my goodness, check it out. Today we're gonna to be looking at Castle Miner Z. This is a pretty cool game. It's like an Xbox port. We're just gonna play offline today. We're gonna to check it out. I've kind of got my feet wet just a little bit. We're gonna try the old survival mode and we're gonna see what we can do. For all of you like Minecraft fans, this game is gonna be very familiar and like it's gonna bring back a lot of cool memories. Um, right away, you're gonna notice it's very similar. It, it, it looks, you know, it's um very similar to Minecraft. Um, I wouldn't say it's a clone, but it probably is. Let's go and check it out. So right away, you gotta notice we can jump around. The controls are very familiar. Um, if you wanted just to dig, you can use like, okay, well, I just placed down a torch accidentally. Let's use our bare hands. We can punch the dirt here. And we got ourselves a dirt block. If I go over this way, I can chop down this tree guaranteed. Oh, I accidentally placed down the, oh my goodness, this is really annoying. Uh, there we go. Okay, this time I'm punching with my left hand and it looks like it's a little quicker. We're holding some bullets. It's kind of cool. They give you a pickaxe, a gun, a knife, some bullets, some, some torches to start, some torches. What is kind of nice is you don't have to start like really like simple right at the beginning. So you got a few resources. So if you grab some wood right away, you can hack this up. Now so I'm going to chop down the whole tree. So hopefully the leaves fall down because that's always a pet peeve of mine. Is that everything? Yep. Okay. So what we'll also notice to craft, I think you press the, what is it, the, one of these, there we go. You press the E button and it pretty much brings up your entire, this is like your crafting menu. So if I was to go up to my wood, I think you can click craft. And from this I can actually make, from the wood log, I can make wood. So there we have it. Now from wood logs, which is what it is, I can make just where to go. That's dirt, there it is, the wood. So that's pretty cool. So if I click craft. I can also make sticks. Let's create some sticks. Now, I can't create any torches because I need coal. I can't create a lantern because I need some iron and some coal and some sand. Okay. So, these are kind of the cool things we got. We got a clock, a compass. Let's uh, let's see if we can get ourselves an axe, maybe. Stone pickaxe, iron pickaxe, oh, a shovel. Um, can I? Oh, okay. So, we're going to need some actual other stone axe. There it is. So, we need some stone to do that. So, We've been given a pickaxe, which is kind of nice. So let's equip our pickaxe. Where'd it go? And let's go and grab some stone. Um, quick, easy stone. There's a hole over here. I think I saw a hole. Yeah, there's a hole right here. Any stone? Let's see. What if I dig down? All right, there we go. Like usual, you can't find stone. Just dig down, and there it is. I do kind of like how the character's a little more rounded. I have to admit, I'm a little, like, uh, when I play video games, I get a little nauseous sometimes. The game's too fluid, and this game's making me a little dizzy. So if you guys are, like, susceptible to getting dizzy playing video games, I wouldn't necessarily recommend this one. It's not as bad as most. Like, I can withstand this for a little bit, but if I had to play this for a few hours, I'd probably get pretty seasick. So we got ourselves some stone now. Let's jump. Oh, boy, I got dizzy there. Okay, so let's go back. We press the E button, and now if we go to our crafting menu, I should be able to make... A stone spade. Awesome. And a stone axe. Where did, our did I make a stone axe? Awesome, I did. So if we get out of that menu and we close that, we go stone axe. So this time if I go to this tree, I should be able to chop this down in like record time. The animation's pretty cool. It is faster than when I use my bare hands, thankfully. I do like the breaking, uh, I do like the breaking, I guess the, the animation. Lost the words there. So this is typical for a voxel game. It's pretty blocky. I don't actually know how they did this. Like, oh boy. So here we are, we're underground now. So if I go further down, I got this on easy. So there shouldn't be too many mobs down here. But if we like plop down a torch, lights up the whole place. Let's grab our stone pickaxe. And we should be able to hack away at this. Awesome. So we should get us some torch, or sorry, some coal to make some torches. What is nice is you don't need to carry around a, uh, a crafting bench so I kind of like that so let's grab our coal and let's see if we can make ourselves some more torches when we go to craft there's some torches yeah oh wait sticks oh yeah I used up all my sticks so we'll make some more sticks I kind of like it how you got this it's like a crafting level crafting table level three so that you can pre-make these you don't have to carry shit with you now we don't have any iron that's easily found just yet I don't want to delve too deep I'll probably die um, it looks like it's cloudy I don't see a day night cycle Let's go check out this castle, because the game is called Castle Miners. So, maybe we can go in right here. Is this obsidian? Yeah, I cannot mine that. Maybe there's a, a gate right at the bottom. Is there a door? 
Nope. Oh, that's bedrock. Okay. So let's get our spade. I know I made a spade. Is it inventory? How do I get to our spade? E? Yep. Okay. So you grab your spade. You can probably just do a swap. There we go. Awesome. Back out. So if I go to the spade. Yeah, it keeps going down. I'm not sure how to get into this thing. All right. When in doubt, if we can't go down, maybe we got to go up. There seems to be some shit at the top. So why don't we build upwards? Now, how many, how many, can we just nerd pull up? Oh, yeah. So if I go craft and I turn these into wood. All right. Awesome. So I'm going to put these into my inventory now. Uh, maybe right where my spade was. Put our spade away. And let's nerd pull right up. Let's do this. So there we go. We're getting up there. Okay, we're going to keep climbing up. Hopefully I don't fall down. I'm not holding shift. Okay, we're at the top. Not quite. So, well, it looks like we're at the top of the world, actually. this is the, I'm not allowed to put down any more blocks. This is the top. Um, the draw distance isn't the greatest. You can see I only got pretty much like one big chunk, but it's pretty cool. That's that lantern that we couldn't actually craft earlier. So let's see, can I, uh, what? awesome, I made it to the top, let's get our pickaxe out, I cannot break the lantern with that, can I just, I can't, okay, I guess that's permanent, I took some fall damage, alright, well there you have it guys, Castle Miner Z, a quick look at an awesome Minecraft clone, tell me guys what you think, if you want to see more videos like this, let me know, thanks again for watching, please check out the channel, we check out new games every day, thanks again, see you next time. Bye!